We've got a three speed, uh, I think from a 55 Merc, and um, it has the R10 Borg Warner overdrive. And we've got the cable pushed in on the dash so that um, yeah, the overdrive will engage when we get above 27 miles per hour and if we're not on the, not on the gas. So the way this thing works, of course, is you put it in gear and it's straight transmission, straight gearing all the way up through. First gear, second, still straight. Won't kick into overdrive until I let off. Just kick the overdrive right there. Now basically I'm in a third gear. So what I can do, if I want to, of course I'm going pretty fast right now, but if I want to, I can get up to next gear, which would be already be an overdrive, and it's got a kick down switch under my gas pedal that if I'm in overdrive and I need to get around somebody or need to get passing gear, quote unquote, um, best use if you're in third overdrive, just stomp that and then it'll momentarily kick out uh, the distributor, momentarily ground it, and I'll be momentarily like a split second, and just that misfire takes the torque off of that ball engagement back there, and the ball green really, um, it goes back to your overdrive sun gear, and when that happens, it'll let that um, overdrive really release, and it'll go into straight gear, and then you're pretty much being straight drive, and it'll stay that way until you let off the gas again. Then, of course, it'll, it'll kick in uh, automatically. The solenoid will uh, be engaged with it at the speed that you're at above 27. But uh, very responsive. Very responsive. Um, I like the wide block and I like it with uh, that Excel 2020 ignition, no points, uh, just a shutter that does. Uh, Spins around there with your with your uh, rotor underneath your distributor cap, telling it when to fire. And uh, man, it's been super reliable. And this carburetor, this Holly I got on it here, it's really, really good. 600 CFM manual choke. And uh, I did have to put a little larger nozzle on it than what I got from the uh, company that remanufactured it, but um, it wasn't much of a big deal at all. So now it's, man, you stomp the gas.